Greetings and welcome to this new video. In this video, I will show you how to get the latest emojis from iOS 15 and iOS 16 on your older iPhone that is running iOS 10.3.3 or 10.3.4. So this will work on iPhone 5 or iPhone 5C or any other device that is running iOS 10.3.3 or 10.3.4. You will need to be jailbroken the jailbreak guide for ios 10.3.3 or 10.3.4 is in the description after that you will get cdr now go to the sources tab you will have to add these repos first of all is the repo.charis.com and second one is the poomsmart.github.io slash repo simply hit on add simply hit on edit then add now just put the address here and click add source. I have already added these sources. So now open the Poom Smarts repo. Go to all packages and find here a package called Emoji Font Manager. Simply install this package onto your device. Click install, confirm. Now simply restart Spring Boot. After the respring, go back in and again open Cydia. Now again go to sources and go to the Poom Smarts repo, all packages. Now you will have to install another package called Emoji iOS 15.4 EFM. If you scroll down, you can note that it has been updated to support the latest emojis in iOS 15.5. Simply install this package. All right, when this is done, just return to Cydia. Go to sources again. Go to the Poom Smash repo, all packages. Now search for this package called Emoji Port iOS 10.0 to 11.4. Now simply open it and install this package. Now simply click confirm. When this is done, simply restart Springboard. Now go in, open settings, scroll down and you will see Emoji Font Manager. It will be set to default, set it to Emoji 15.4 and hit respring you're back now you are good to go you open the notes app and we'll test out the new emojis all right guys here you can see that we have the latest emojis from ios 15 or 16 and they are working pretty well every emoji is working just fine all right guys as you can see we have successfully ported the latest emojis from iOS 15 or 16 to iOS 10.3.3 or 10.3.4. That's all for this video guys. If you still have questions, you can always ask me in the comments section. And I will see you in a new video. Goodbye.